Hi guys, this is Oprah from Winfrey.com and today I thought I'd show you Google Trends Visualizer. This has been released recently and it's a beautiful way to find out what people are searching currently. On the bottom left you can change what area you'd like to see the searches coming from but as you can see it changes colors based on what people see and on the top left you can actually change it to do more than one search term at one time. It actually goes all the way up to 25 so as you can see very nice it does slow down a little bit for me but I'm screen recording so that's probably why but as you can see changes colors very nice thing to have so I thought what about having this as a screensaver this would be pretty good normally we have things like bubbles and things like that uh, we also have I don't know swirly stuff but this is actually kind of useful um, you can see from across the room for example what people are searching on the latest news without even having to be at a computer because it's nice and easy to read so it's very simple to do this. You simply need to get a web page screensaver file. This is an .scr screensaver file. Download it and put it into your Windows System 32 folder. So this is the file you'll get. Just drag it into C Windows System 32 or whatever your drive is. And all you need to do after that is go to Personalize, Screensaver, select it, and then choose Settings. And here you will find the web page screensaver settings. All you need to do is paste in which one you'd like to see. Now, if we go back to the web page, uh, sorry, the visualizer, you'll see at the top that there is a link that's given to you. Now, this is the link for just one view, and you can go ahead and do, for example, four views, and it will give you a different link at the top. So simply copy that link and put it into the web page address to open paste it, click OK. It's not going to show you it in the preview, or it didn't at least for me, and then click preview, and hopefully there we go. It's a little bit slower than it is normally, but it's a great way to see what's being searched from, like I said, across the room or if you're AFK, things like that. Um, one disadvantage is that you do see that a little scroll bar on the right hand side, but it's not that big of a deal. Uh, but you can use that web page screen saver for any website if you wish to see it uh, when you're not at your computer. So it's a nice way to see things. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.